the head of my life, to Minister Lorel, Mother Teresa on the phone, to all the saints. God is a good God. How many have of you have heard the term here lately about woke? And I thank you, Father, for Jordan George Johnson. In the name of yes. Jesus. Oh, yes. Is there anything too hard for God? Oh. Father, I thank you for Jordan being here. In Jesus' name. In the name thank of you, Jesus, Lord. How many of you have heard about being woke? Uh-huh. 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 It's used in a negative sense. Uh-huh. There's a governor that says woke. Mm -hmm. His state is where woke comes to die. They use it in a lying way. But I'm going to talk to you today about the woke generation right. from God's word. All right now. Psalm 24, verses 7 through 10. Thank you, Lord. It says, lift up your heads, O ye gates. And be ye lift up, ye everlasting doors, and the king of glory shall come in. Yes. Who is this king of glory? Yes. The Lord strong and mighty. The Lord mighty in battle. Yes. Lift up your heads, O ye gates. O ye gates. Even lift them up, ye everlasting doors, and the king of glory shall come in. Yeah. Who is this king of glory? The Lord of hosts, he is the king of glory, Selah. Mm -hmm. Mother Teresa got quite a lift today. Yes, by Sister yes. Jennifer and Sister Brittany and Jordan being in the house of God. <laughs> is there anything yes. too hard for God? He does hear and answer Ooh, prayer. Yeah. Let's go to Ephesians, the fifth chapter. We have to counteract lies with the truth of God's all, word. All the time. All Thank the time. you, Jesus. Yeah. Ephesians 5, 6 through 21. Talking about being, we need to not be sleeping in these last wait, and evil wait, days. Wait, we better wait, know what's wait, going on around us. Wait. <laughs> Ephesians 5 and 6 yeah. says let no man deceive you with vain words that means no man no politician no, no man. news no reporter no, no news anchor no. let no man no deceive man. you with vain words yeah. okay. okay it's at the point now right here at a uh, Black History Month, right. where you can't even teach the truth about African American history yeah. because people might feel bad. bad. Well, if you would teach them what we endure, maybe they would have some empathy and they would stop mocking our African American athletes by making monkey noises at them as they're playing okay. and calling them the N-word. If you would teach them the truth of our history, right. maybe they would have some compassion and they wouldn't do these things. Maybe. But, amen. It's the truth. Maybe. It's worth the truth. Truth yeah. went out over a lot yeah. every yeah. time. All right. yeah. We can do nothing against the truth, but for the truth. Yeah. You can't erase the contributions we've made to this country All through right. lying words or trying to suppress the truth. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Lord. That's right. Let no man deceive you with vain words, for because of these things cometh the wrath of God upon the children of disobedience. Right. Be not ye therefore partakers with them, for ye were sometimes darkness. But now are ye light in the Lord. Walk as children of light. For the fruit of the Spirit is in all goodness and righteousness and truth. Yeah, and truth yeah. Proving what is acceptable unto the Lord. And have no fellowship with the unfruitful works of darkness. But rather reprove or expose them. Mm -hmm. For it is a shame even to speak of those things which are done of them in secret. All right. But how many of us know God sees everything? He does oh, yeah. too. But all things that are reproved are made manifest by the light. For whatsoever doth make manifest is light. Wherefore he said, Awake thou that sleepest. 
Hallelujah. And arise from the dead. And Christ shall give thee life. That's what happens when we accept Jesus Christ. See then that ye walk circumspectly, carefully, not as fools, but as wise. We've got to be wise as serpents and harmless as doves. Redeeming the time. Make the most of this time, because the days are evil. Right. Wherefore be ye not unwise, but understanding what the will of the Lord is. Yeah. We got to know. And be not drunk with wine, yeah. wherein is excess, but be filled with the Spirit. The Bible says wine is a mocker, yeah. and strong drink is raging, and they that are deceived thereby are not wise. So we want to be wise, speaking to yourselves in songs and hymns and spiritual songs, singing and making melody in your heart to the Lord, giving thanks always for all things unto God and the Father in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, submitting yourselves one to another in the fear of God. If we fear God, we won't do certain things. True. If we fear God, we won't go certain places. Mm -hmm. We won't commit certain acts mm -hmm. if we fear God. Yeah. And wisdom the, is the principal thing. Mm -hmm. The fear of God is the beginning of wisdom and knowledge. Yeah. So we need to learn how to fear God, oh, the yeah. one who made us. The one it is in him that we live, we move, we have our being. We couldn't be here without God. Oh, no. We couldn't take the next breath without him. Yeah, that is so true. Thank you, Lord. We not only have to learn how to fear him, we have to learn how to love him. Yes. Yes. We love yes. God, then we love ourselves, and we love our neighbor as we love ourselves. Right. If we would do that, we would be in good shape. Yes. Matthew 24, verses 21 through 24. Mm -hmm. Matthew 24, verse 21, says, For then shall be great tribulation, such as was not since the beginning of the world to this time, no, nor ever shall be. And except those days should be shortened, there should no flesh be saved. But for the elects, the chosen ones, for their sake, those days shall be shortened. Then if any man shall say unto you, Lo, here is Christ, or there, believe it not. For there shall arise false Christ and false prophets, and shall show great signs and wonders, insomuch that, if it were possible, they shall deceive the very elect. Oh, yes. Yeah. Saints of God, people of God, there's no excuse for us allowing people to deceive us. That's true, very true, very true. Okay? If we are sensitive to the Spirit of God, yes. we won't be deceived. No, no. But we don't want to become dull of hearing mm -hmm. to where we can no longer hear what the Spirit is saying to us. Yes. We can no longer get direction. So we've got to be sensitive to the Spirit of God. Yeah. Romans 13, verses 10 through 14 says, Love worketh no ill to his neighbor. That's right. Therefore, love is the fulfilling of the law. Yeah. You know, people say, I love you, but if they're dogging you out, where is the love? Oh, Lord. Yeah. Oh, Lord. I'm just saying. Word of God said, love working no ill to his name. Don't leave it. Okay? And that knowing the time, knowing that it. now it is high time mm. to awake out of sleep. Yeah. I'm still talking about yeah. the woke generation. That's good. That's good. For now is our salvation nearer than when we believe, yeah. than when we first believe. The night is far spent. It is. The day is at hand. Yes. Let us, therefore, cast off the works of darkness. Oh, yeah. And let us put on the armor of light. Yes. Let us walk honestly as in the day. Not in rioting and drunkenness. Not in chambering 
that means revelry mm -hmm. and wantonness, not in strife and envy, but put ye on the Lord Jesus Christ and make no provision for the flesh to fulfill the lust thereof. Right. We don't owe this flesh nothing. Because when we were out there cutting up, acting a fool, the devil was wearing us out. We don't owe this flesh nothing. Crucify me, Lord. Bring it under subjection. Crucify. That's what we have to do. Yes. Now, I'm going to read about the generation we don't want to be a part of. Let's go to Proverbs 30. Proverbs 30, 11 through 14. Proverbs 30, 11 through 14 says, there is a generation mm -hmm. that curses their father and does not bless their mother. Mm -hmm. There is a generation oh my. that are now. pure in their You're own now. eyes, yes. and now. yet is not washed from their You're filthiness. And they're washed in the blood mm -hmm. of the crucified lamb. Oh there is a generation, is. oh how lofty, just arrogant, yes. are their eyes, and their yes. eyelids are lifted up. And God resists the proud, he gives grace unto the humble. Yeah. There's a generation whose teeth are as swords yeah. and their jaw, jaw teeth as knives Touchy. to devour the poor from off the earth and the needy from among them. Right. That We don't want to be in that generation, mm -hmm. okay? We want to be in the woke generation. Oh, yeah. The next time you hear that term woke, you just let your mind run right back to what the word of God says. Yes, yes. Thank you, Jesus. Please. Jesus Please. came into the world and he was yes. and was the light of the world. And we want to walk in light and not in darkness. Yes. We've been brought out of darkness yes. into over yes. into this marvelous yes. life. If you haven't started your journey, it's time to get on your way. Yes. It's time to seek the Lord. Oh, yes. right. This is the generation of them that seek him. Oh, yes. That's where we want to be. Oh, yes. 1 Corinthians 15, 33 through 34. All right. 1 Corinthians 15, 33 says, Be not deceived. All right. It's a warning, people of God. Mm -hmm. Be not deceived. Evil communications corrupt good manners. Oh, God. Yes, it does. Awake to righteousness mm -hmm. and sin not. Yes. For some have not this knowledge of God. I speak this to your shame. Oh, God. You know, Jesus would heal people mm -hmm. and he would tell them, Go and sin no and more. No more. One man who told him, go and sin no more. That's the worst the thing come, come upon you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, we Jesus did his part. He did. He by did. coming here he as did. a little baby. Mm -hmm. Growing up, mm -hmm. and as a man, he went to the cross. Mm -hmm. yeah. Hung there. Mm -hmm. Bled. Mm -hmm. Died for us. Yeah. Thank God on the third day he got up with all power. And as the song says, what more can Jesus do? He already made the way. Jesus said, I am the way. I'm the truth and I'm the life. People stumbling around trying to find their way. All you got to do is give your heart to Jesus. He is the way. There is no other way. Not to God the, the Father except through Jesus. You yeah. can't get around him. Can't. As the son said, you got to come in at the door. Oh, yeah. Jesus oh, said, I am the door. He is. You can't get by Jesus. There's no other way. No, no. A lie will tell you Buddha, you can worship Buddha. You know, a lie tell you you can worship. There's many ways to yeah. God. Yeah. Right. How many of us know the devil is a liar? He, is. he was a liar yeah. from the beginning and yeah. abode yeah. not in the yeah. truth. Yeah. There's yeah. no truth in him. Yeah. The truth is Jesus saying, I am the way. The, way. the truth and the life. No man. no man. I don't care who you are. Okay. No man comes to the Father no. except by no. me. There is no other way. Not I thank God for Jesus that he 
made a way. He did yeah. do. Where there yeah. seemed oh, to be yeah. no way. Yeah. He made a way. All right. Thank yeah. you, yeah. Jesus. Thank Jordan, you. love you, sweetie, if you have to leave. Love you, dear. Oh, First Thessalonians 5. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. First Thessalonians 5. Verses 1 through 11. It says, But of the times and the seasons, brethren, ye have no need that I write unto you. All right. For yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief right. in the night. Right. Now I don't have time to say, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I would have expected you, Lord, if I had just had more time. My God, my God. Tomorrow Amen. is not promised Amen. to us. Amen. Jesus is coming back to rapture up his people. Yes, We're going to be yes, caught yes. up oh, yes. in the clouds to meet the Lord in the yes, air. Yes, and so yes. shall we ever be with the Lord. Those that aren't saved or the saved that got careless and fell asleep, Wait. weren't spiritually All right. woke, Right. We'll be left behind. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay? Yeah. You won't be coming back with Christ for that thousand year no, millennial no. reign. No, no. So you won't have time to get ready. You know, a thief don't announce when they're coming. No. No. When they broke in my house a, a couple of Sundays ago, they didn't call me up and tell me they were going to do it. Mm -mm. No. Amen. Okay, Jesus is coming that same way like a thief in the night. And Jesus warned us to set our treasure on things above and not here on the earth where thieves break through and steal. They do what they do. Okay? For when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them. As travail or labor upon a woman with child, yes. and they shall not escape. Yes, yes. But ye, brethren, mm -hmm. ye saints of God, mm -hmm. are not in darkness, no, no. that that day should overtake you as a thief. All right. mm -hmm. Ye are all the children of light and the children of the day. We are not of the night nor of the darkness. No, no. We used to be. Used to. Okay? Right. Therefore, let us not sleep as do sleep. others, but let us watch and be sober. Be that sober. don't mean go, not uh, that you don't sleep at night, because no, he's giving his beloved sleep. Yes. That just means spiritually, mm -hmm. don't be found asleep. Well. For they that sleep, sleep in the night, and they that be drunken are drunken in the night. Right. But let us, who are of the day, be sober putting on the breastplate of faith and love, and for an helmet, the hope of salvation. Right. For God have not appointed us to wrath. Okay, we won't be here during that great tribulation time, seven years of tribulation. And you think things are bad now. Okay. You ain't seen nothing yet okay. until the Holy Ghost dispensation is over with, the praying saints of God been lifted okay. up out of here. Okay. God have mercy today. For God has not appointed us to wrath, but to obtain salvation by our Lord Jesus Christ, who died for us, that whether we wake or sleep, saints of God, we should live together with him. Wherefore, comfort yourselves together and edify or build up one another, even as also ye do. Right. But we got to be woke in these last and be. evil be. days. You know, we can't walk around That's just, me. you know, like we don't know which way to go. People have thought there's no excuse. Uh -uh. If you don't know which way to go, ask God. Right. As the book of James said, you have not because she ask That's not. not. If you ask him, he will show you will the way be. to go. And the Holy Ghost will lead, direct it. He will lead and he guide will. you he into will. all he truth. Will. Yes, he will do that. He I'm will. almost done here. He'll do that. He'll do that. All truth. God bless him. Thank you, Lord. Let's go to Second Peter. God is such a good God. It's so good to see you all in the house of the Lord today. Second Peter 2, 
verses 1 through 9, says, But there were false prophets also among the people, yes. even as there shall be false teachers among you who privately shall bring in damnable heresy, which is something that doesn't comport or is not aligned with the word of God. Right. Even denying the Lord that brought them and shall bring upon themselves swift destruction. Mm -hmm. And many shall follow their pernicious ways, their destructive ways, mm -hmm. by reason of whom the way of truth shall be evil spoken. Yes. And through covetousness, greedy for money, shall they with feign or deceptive words make merchandise of you whose judgment now of a long time lingereth not, and their damnation slumbereth not. Those people that are trying to deceive, they're trying to mm -hmm. get you to buy their books, mm -hmm. they're trying to get you to send in money yeah. for their causes. They're making merchandise of you. God, is there anything too hard for God? God bless you, Jordan Patrick. I tell you, God is doing some marvelous things. Thank you, Lord. God knows how to lift his people. If God be for you, who can be against you? Thank God, thank God for our children. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. If this don't lift you, I don't know. This, with the word of God and sin, the people who come back to the house of God, if that don't lift you, God help you. I don't know what will. Oh bless him. Hallelujah. I'm encouraged today. Yes. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. It said, for if God spare not the angels that sin, but cast them down to hell. Yes. And deliver them into chains of darkness to be reserved unto judgment. And spare not the old world, but save Noah, the eighth person, a preacher of righteousness, bringing in the flood upon the world of the ungodly, and turning the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah into ashes, condemn them with an overthrow. What makes the United States of America think we're going to skate back? Right. Making them Amen. an example Amen. unto those that after should live ungodly. Right. And deliver just lot, vexed with the filthy conversation of the mm -hmm. wicked, mm -hmm. for that righteous man dwelling among them and seeing and hearing vexed his righteous soul from day to day with their unlawful deeds. The Lord knoweth how to deliver the godly out of temptation. Saints, we're left without an excuse. When he makes a way to escape, you better take it. And to reserve the unjust unto the day of judgment to be punished. We're going to end with St. Mark 13. But we want to be known as the woke generation, according to God's word. Thank you, Lord. St. Mark 13. You know, people don't mind twisting the word of God. They really don't even think you don't know. If, it, if they think it'll profit them to gain a political office mm -hmm. uh -huh. or finances, right. mm -hmm. no problem. No problem. St. Mark 13, mm -hmm. verses 30 mm -hmm. through 30. Seven. And Jesus is speaking here. Mm -hmm. Verily I say unto you that this generation shall not pass till all these things be done. And he told them up above in those scriptures what it was going to be like when he would appear in the clouds with power and great glory. Heaven and earth shall pass away. But my word shall not pass away. No, no. But of that day and that hour knoweth no man, no, not the angels which are in heaven, neither the Son, but the Father. Yes, That's what makes God God. Yeah. He's God all by himself. All right. Take ye heed. Watch and pray. All right. For ye know not when the time is. For the Son of Man 
he, he's referring to himself in a parable, mm -hmm. is as a man taking a far journey yes. who left his house and gave authority to his servant and to every man his word mm -hmm. and commanded the porter or the doorkeeper to watch. Mm -hmm. Watch ye therefore, for ye know not when the master of the house cometh, at even or evening, or at midnight, or at the cock crowing, or in the morning, okay. that's coming suddenly, he okay. finds you sleeping. Okay. And what I say unto you, I say unto all, watch. watch. Don't let him catch you spiritually asleep, mm -hmm. because you have gotten careless along the way, or because you haven't given your heart to the Lord. So God is a good God. Anybody want prayer today, just raise your hand. If you just need the Lord to help you today. He sees you. He knows. Yes, if we ever needed the Lord before, we sure do need it now. Don't let him catch you with your works undone. Don't let him catch you unsaved. Don't let him catch you backsling. Don't let him catch you careless and, and not paying attention to what's going on in the world. He warned that there will be fearful sights from heaven. Look at that balloon flying around from town. Come on, folks. What is that? We're living in the last and evil days. Yeah. Don't be surprised what you see. You not Don't be surprised it. what you hear. That's, That's why we got to walk by faith and not by sight. Father, it is in the name of Jesus that I thank you for the warning. God, I thank you. Help us, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Lord, we all stand in need of you. I ask you, Father, in the name of Jesus to touch, heal, and deliver today. You're still able to heal. You're still able to forgive. You're still able to deliver. Hey, hey. Father God, I pray for mercy in for our Jesus. children, Lord God. In mercy the in the name of Jesus. Let your mercy and your favor rest upon them, Lord. Be a hedge around them, Lord. God, those that don't know you in the pardon of their sins, I pray in the name of Jesus. You would draw their minds out of the world. That you would give them a mind to want to be saved. I thank you, God, for sending them in the house today. In the name of Jesus, I thank you for the love that you have toward each and every one of us. You loved us so much that you sent your, you gave your only begotten son. That whosoever believeth in you will not perish, but have everlasting life. And Jesus loved us so much, he gave his life for us. Now, Father, I pray you will work in our children. In the name of Jesus, bless them near and far, Lord. Thank you, Father. And whatever's accomplished, we'll be careful to give your name all the praise, honor, and the glory. In Jesus' name, work on the Lord. Work on the Lord in the name of Jesus. Thank you for your love. Thank you. By your course of love, draw them to you. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, Jesus. You may be seated. He loves you in this. Yes, yes. Thank you, Lord. Thank God. He loves you, Joy. Thank you, Lord. He loves you, young man. He loves us all. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Jesus oh, yeah. said, greater love and no man than this, that he would lay down his life for his friends. He didn't die for us to continue in sin. He died to save us from our sin. Yes, yes. Just come to us. Jen and Brittany, love you. So good to see you, all of you. Yes. So at this time, we sharper than any two-headed sword, and it cuts asunder. Yes. It's so yes. good to know what the word of the Lord says. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Come to Jesus. Wow. You got time. Come on in this house. It's going to rain, everyone. Oh, thank you. It's going to rain. It's going to rain. It's going to rain. And while you got the strength, the blood running warm in your veins, come on in this house. Thank you. Come on to Jesus. It's good to see 
to all of you. It's good to see you in the house of God on the very first Sunday in the month of February. Thank you. God is a good God. Good word, good word, Thank good you. word. I must say that confirmed my message that I was supposed to bring on the Friday night that I'm supposed to preach. Awake, Praise awake, him. awake, Praise awake, him. awake. Praise so God is a good God. Yes, I love him for confirming his word. Oh, yeah. Thank God, thank God. We do have a conference call number. It is 667-770-1373. Access code 274-487-POUND. We are there on Tuesdays at 12 o'clock for prayer. Wednesday, 6 o'clock for Bible study. And Friday night, praise and worship service. There's something going on on that line. So dial in and see what the will of the Lord is for your life. We appreciate you very much. And thank you for tuning in. God bless. God bless. Thank you. God.